This is the most important tutorial for cleaning up your topology. I'm going to show you three very simple tricks for how you can clean up your topology. And these are going to help you make your meshes a lot more organized. Your stuff is going to look a lot more professional if you apply this. This is probably the easiest way to improve your topology. So I'm working on this AK-47 model right here. And I intentionally messed up the topology a little bit so I can demonstrate how I'm going to clean this up with the help of a few tools. So the first and the easiest method that I'm going to show you is how you can use a 3D cursor to clean your shit up. For example, right here, we have this geometry, we have these edges which are zigzagging left and right, everything's all fucked up. And there's a very simple trick with the 3D cursor which we can use to just simply align this a little bit better. So in this case, we don't want this edge to be zigzagging left and right. We just want the straight edge going straight down from this one right here. We just want this to continue going down and not left and right. So in other words, we want to align these edges over here with these edges up here. So to do that, we're gonna select a vertex up here on the straight edge, we're gonna press Shift S, Cursor is selected, then we're going to switch our pivot point to the 3D cursor. Now we have to select all the geometry that we want to align with this point right here. We can do that by simply selecting one vertex and then control right clicking on another vertex at the other end of this loop. It's gonna select everything in between those two points. Now you can just press S to scale, X to scale on the X axis, and then just press number zero and that's going to flatten everything on the X axis and align it with this exact point. And if you repeat this on all the other edges, you're going to turn all your zigzag lines into straight lines and stuff is going to be a little bit more aligned. You can also do this on the Z axis, you can do this on the Y axis, and it's a very universally applicable method of cleaning up your topology. Now I'm going to show you another way to clean up some other problems. Now here's situation number two. We have a point down here which is connected to a point up here. So these two vertices should be connected but they're sitting at a different height. And we don't want to have this messy edge connected, we want to have a nice straight line. So how can we get a straight line here? Well there's a very simple tool that allows you to do this. To get this tool you have to go up here to edit, preferences, go to add-ons, type in loop, and activate the add-on called loop tools. Now, if you select all the edges that connect those two vertices, you can turn them into a perfectly straight line while still keeping the length between them, which is going to allow them to align with these other edges here that go vertically. So to do that, press W, go to loop tools, select G stretch and set the method to project. As you can see, now we have a laser straight line, but the distances between the edges are still aligned with the vertical edges here. You also have some different G stretch methods here. So try to play around with those and see how they can be used as well. And here's probably the most important trick for cleaning up your topology. We're going to look at this example right here at the top of this model. We have a grid of edges and vertices, but it looks like a complete mess. The reason it looks like a mess is because these edges don't have the same distance between them. The distance between the beginning and this edge is this edge right here. Then we have a massive stretch between these next two edges. Then another big stretch between these two edges and a small edge here. It's completely inconsistent. There's a tool which very easily allows us to equalize the spaces between these edges. So in this case, we're going to select all the vertical edge loops and we're going to use a special tool to make this, the length of those edges equal. So once we select all the edge loops that we want to equalize, press W, go to loop tools and hit space. As you can see, now these edges have equal space between them, as opposed to what we had before over here, which creates the problems. So now if you do this on other places as well, your model is going to start to look a lot cleaner. And these are the three most important tools for cleaning up your topology. So make sure you learn how to use these three tools so you don't have bullshit topology and you actually have impressive presentable work. Let me know what you want to see next. I'll see you guys in the next video.